This may have happened to you. When you were a child, your parents may have asked you to eat every morsel of food on your plate because, you know, the kids in Africa don't have enough to eat. Well, I grew up in Africa, in Zambia, and when my mom used to tell me to eat everything off my plate, I didn't have to think about kids far away. I now find myself responsible for managing food waste at an almost unimaginable scale. I work for MGM Resorts International. Now, you may not think about Las Vegas when you think about good food waste management practices, but the surprising truth is, we've been figuring out what to do with food waste for a long time, and now have helped the city develop some of the most comprehensive food waste management practices in the world. We've diverted over 220,000 tons of food waste from landfills. That's the equivalent of over 1,200 blue whales. We've also implemented multiple waste prevention methods, such as using data to drive menu changes. Lessons from Las Vegas can actually inform food waste management practices around the world. But let's step back for a moment and ask, why is food waste a problem worth solving? Based on research by Project Drawdown, reducing food waste is actually the number one global solution to reducing climate change. Let's go back to MGM. By doing waste audits, we uncovered that the largest driver of food waste in our resorts was convention banquets. And the main reason for that was that sometimes people skip group meals when they go to conventions. If you're a meeting planner, use whatever creative methods you can to ensure the attendees at your live event show up to the group meals. Because that's the best thing to do in terms of the EPA food recovery hierarchy. Source reduction, avoid food waste in the first place. Even with the best planning, there may be surplus. So the next best thing to do with that surplus is to feed people in need. And if you're a planner at a venue that doesn't currently rescue food, remind them that there is liability protection for food donors. And if you need to, connect them to the local food bank so they can set up programs. If food surplus cannot be safely recovered for people, then let's feed animals. That's what we've been doing in Las Vegas for the last 10 years. The final preference is compost. Now composting is not very common in cities across the world, but it can be. And the key is ensuring the disposable products and food you're sending for composting can actually be composted in the region in which it's used. So there you have it, Las Vegas, a global food waste leader with great practices at every level of the EPA food recovery hierarchy. Who knew? Many of these programs were developed in partnership with meeting planners. And so with your advocacy and support, the same ideas can be replicated in cities around the world. So what can we do about food waste? A lot. And by doing so, we'll not only make our parents happy by thinking about the kids in Africa, but we'll also maybe make our children happy by collectively working as adults to address the number one solution in the global fight against climate change.